A plant! A plant is controlling a robot and we're controlling the plant. Is the Ember Shed and if you guys in Prodigy. Hey, what's going on everyone? One Doctor Genius here and in this video we're gonna be going over the top five coolest pets in Prodigy. Right guys, so without further ado, let's hop on straight into our video. Alright guys, so number one, probably the coolest pet in the entire game is the Ember Shed. And if you guys don't believe me, well, over 100,000 people agree with me. Well, not even 100,000, 300,000? No, it's more than 300,000. So you guys can tell a lot of people agree with me that the Ember Shed is the coolest pet. I mean, it's one of the most viewed videos on my channel. Alright guys, so now over here, we have the Ember Shed, right? So obviously, by first looks, you guys can tell it's a dragon. And it basically looks really nice, like the color scheme and the shading is okay, but what really is look looks good about this is its wings and its tail on fire and basically like its color scheme and the armored plating. Right, like this guy just looks so fierce and angry that he's ready to go into battle. And basically if you guys ask me, it just looks like the good pet to have on your team in total. Like just look at these eyes, they're like, I will pierce through your soul and know your deepest secrets. Right, so yeah, if you guys ask me, the Ember Shed does look absolutely amazing and its wings are nice, right? I wonder if they can fly using their wings, and not only that, its attack animation looks pretty cool, right? Yeah. Here's a glimpse of its attack animation. Well, so yeah, there's that. And then I do like the color scheme of the pet because blue is one of my favorite colors. So yeah. And then not only that, it also looks like the sea serpent. Like it has a dragon type look and a sea serpent. And it also looks like the snake. Fun fact, did you guys know I've held the six foot python before? Right, yeah. So other than that, those are basically the reasons because it looks like the sea serpent, dragon, and python. So yeah. That's why this pet gets a rank on my list as number two in the coolest. Right now, you guys can agree with me, disagree with me. Scream at each other in the comments, just comment down below, whatever you want. So yeah, ooh. Hey guys, com spam ABCD in the comments. So anyways, now an honorable mention which I'll do is for the Scribble, Scrabble, and Scroll. Right guys, so now, the, right now, the art of this pet doesn't really look too good, but the old versions did look pretty lit. So yeah, old versions get a shout out, new versions just look like doo doo. Alright guys, so now, obviously you guys know dragons and monsters and creepy crawlies seem to be the theme of what I like right now. So over here you guys can see we have ancient dinosaurs and the pterosaur. I mean guys tell me that the pterosaur is not looking cool. It's like named after the Tyrannosaurus Rex which is one of the most popular dinosaurs if you guys ask me. And not only that but you guys can tell its backbone looks pretty cool because it looks like the bone is growing out of its back and its feet. I mean the main reason of this thing is its fiery mane. Just look at it. Its head looks like it's on fire and super cool. Alright, other than that, this just looks like an old angry grandpa. <laughs> this looks like an old angry grandpa, if you guys ask me, just look at those eyes like, Ugh, you kids get off my lawn. <laughs> so yeah, other than that, basically the fiery main gives this third place on the list. So yeah, it's... It's quite cool because of that. And not only that, I do believe, oh my god, this entire list is basically me giving shoutouts to insect sea creatures and stuff. But yeah, over here we have the Colustro. Basically, this looks like a lobster, a crab, and a scorpion at the same time because you guys can tell the color theme and how it's designed. So now basically, seafood is amazing, sea animals are amazing, so this already ranks on my list. And not only that, the colored theme, and I do think that it's pinchers, the very fun pinchers look absolutely pretty cool, and it's, um, what do you call it? This is humongous and scary, look at how big this is in Crystal Tavern. Ugh. Tiny lobsters. Alright, so here we go. It seems like he stands up and causes an earthquake to happen underneath him, which is amazing. A butt tag animation, it seems like he stands up on his back. And fifth, but definitely not least, we have ourselves, the Batterbot. Basically, this is a mechanical earth robot, and obviously robots are already cool, but this is an earth robot made out of dirt, fighting with your wizard with plants growing inside of him and a plants controlling him. I mean, it's a robot being controlled by a plant. 
a plant. A plant is controlling a robot and we are controlling the plant. So obviously this makes it ultra cool because we're controlling a robot which is controlling a robot. And obviously robots are cool and it just reminds me of like some character from some sort of movie or something IDK. I heard about the character and these um, giant robots look pretty cool so yeah. Good luck to the editor who's gonna try to find that robot as an image reference image. Good luck! But yeah. So basically these are my top 5 favorite pets in the game. You guys can tell they all are actually quite amazing. And there are unique features about them, but I'd recommend you guys stay tuned for part 2 where I tell you more of my favorite pets. And maybe I'll even go over the cutest pets, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, guys, over here. I took a community poll and it seems like we've got 85 votes. And 38% of the people think one Dr. Genius is the strongest the boss. Yes, Prodigy will add me as a boss one day to their game. And I shall obliterate every wizard who dares try opposing me. Right guys, yeah, give this more votes, right? Yeah, so over here you guys can tell me which boss you think is the strongest. Or is the Prodigy wizard the strongest? I don't know, you guys decide. So yeah, back to the video. Alright, yeah, I got an idea for Prodigy. Make a news station like you already have Daily Watch. Maybe add in the avatar of like a few Prodigy news YouTubers. And basically have us giving the news like, Hey, this week we got this. Like just a small avatar, like a little tribute to the YouTubers, you know. That would be nice. Yeah. So, so yeah, I hope you guys found this video informational and entertaining. And if you did, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Obliterate that like button and comment down below. Comment spam. I am Taco Cat. To prove you have watched till the end of this video. And not only that guys, but yeah, share this with your friends. And yeah, I'll be catching y'all next time. One Doctor Genius out the house.